Anyways, welcome back to Supplement Kitchen, Unbiased Reviews, and us two here are not doctors, pediatricians, gynecologists, none of it. None of it. Please consult with your physician before using any products that we review. Disclaimer, or you any will other need to see a therapist after this video. All right. Today, we have a familiar face. We've got that Life Stacks and their Chill, Chill. CBD infused. Let's get started. All right, welcome back. We are chilling in the kitchen with the chill pill. Yeah. <laughs> Get it? Chill pill? Ah, it's funny. Life stacks back in the house here and they're chill. Got that tan flavor. Ooh, boy. It's like desert sand flavor. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but this is their, we already did their flow. This is their chill. Stop it. And serving size is what? Two caps. How do you take it? Uh, orally, you probably took it. That I did. I put it. Yeah, that gets yeah. there quicker. Hey, whatever floats your boat. Uh, yeah. So it says take one to two capsules once or twice daily, or as directed by a healthcare professional, not us. Um, uh, <clears throat> what does it say on here? It says mood, sleep, minerals. Yeah. So that's what it helps with. Um. There's some asterisks, like there would be more information, but I don't see more information. All right. Well, let's get into the label then. All right. So in the label, there is 50 milligrams of niacin, 10 milligrams of vitamin B6, uh, 60 milligrams of magnesium, 12 milligrams of zinc, 1 milligram of copper, uh, 250 milligrams of cat's claw extract, 200 milligrams of valerian root, 150 milligrams of lemon balm extract, 150 milligrams of ashwagandha root, 5 milligrams of CBD isolate, and 2 milligrams of lithium. Dude, they got my cat's claw. That's fucked. It'd be fucked up if they had some camel toe in here. Ooh, that's the next ingredient we're coming up with. Yeah. Anyways, all right, let's get into the performance of how Chill delivers. Um, yeah, so... <clears throat> I took this a couple times, different times. I took it one time, like, right before bed, like, as I was getting ready to lay down. I took it one time, like, about an hour out from bedtime. And then one time I took it, like, three hours out from bedtime. I wouldn't really recommend that you take it three hours out from bedtime because three hours out from bedtime turns into one hour out from bedtime. Um, yeah, one hour, I think one to two is where you're really going to look. Um you take it, I would say probably like half hour, um, and you really just start to like relax. You get that mood elevation. It just kind of seems like just a little relief. Um, I like all the things they had in here, the magnesium, zinc. Um, that was really cool. Um, but yeah, you just take it, super simple, and like an hour later, half hour later, you're relaxed. Yeah, I would take it, uh, I always take a sleep aid. I try and take it like an hour, hour and a half out from sleep. Um, and did this, did that with this every time I took it. Um, and it was like clockwork. It was like yeah. boom, boom, boom. Going to bed just about the same time that I really wanted to. Um, I think, like you said, it kind of, it doesn't like immediately come and sucker punch you to like help <laughs> you fall asleep. It's more like a you kind of ease into like I'm getting drowsy, you know, yeah. something similar to that, and then you fall asleep. But the other thing is, um, not when you wake up the next morning, I think you feel relaxed, re-energized. Re yeah, you feel rejuvenated. Um, it's a cool little spin. I like what these guys are doing. Yeah, because um, a really yeah. cool little spin on these products. Like some sleep aids, you take them and then like you're out and then the problem is, is that you can't really wake up um you don't have that problem with this um i would say that it does kind of help put you to sleep um normally like i get into bed play around on my phone for a couple minutes start getting tired and then i'm like finally out like a half hour into bed um but with this like i got into bed i was like yo i'm out yeah 
But I think from start, like from the time you take it and go to bed yeah. to the time you wake up, it's a full experience, um, positive experience. So I liked it. Yeah. All right. So there's your thoughts. Let's jump into the ratings. Uh, I think mixability was was pretty good. They put them in there good. Yeah, they they fed them in there. Flavor was was I like the sand. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, two is an easy dosage. It's not like taking eight fucking pills. All right, so the real rating on this, let's go with performance and overall. What'd you think, my sir? Um, I think you could easily give this ten. It's a very unique market. Um, CBD, not a lot of like companies are doing it to that level yet. Um, you see like a lot of companies getting in like local and. But they, I think they're doing the right thing. Um, and I like kind of that this is directed towards a specific thing. It's not just like CBD. It's, you know. Yeah, it's a full picture. It's like yeah. the CBD is. The CBD the assists extra, yeah. with everything else. But, uh, I mean, I give it a nine. I liked it. Yeah. Um, something I could see myself using or in cold writing right, really. every yeah. now and then. So. All right. There's our thoughts on the chill. All right, so we're gonna tag lifestyle or yeah, life stack sups up here, what? and we uh, enjoyed it. We did. Head over, check them out. Check out the flow. Check out the chill. Definitely think it's something you could add to your arsenal, and incorporate throughout your days or um, on a cycling period. You know, it's it's really cool. Um, but other than that, I'm good. I'm good. Later. Uh-huh.